Oh, smell that. Countryside. Good evening, folks. Welcome to the channel. My name's Rich, and I'm back out on this beautiful hog. The Harley Davidson 883 Sportster. I've only got it for a short amount of time on loan. Thank you, Bry. Beautiful summer's evening, or well, early summer. Can we call it summer yet? Are we officially summer? I don't know. Well, it bloody well feels like it this week. We've had peaks of about 25 degrees in Derbyshire. I would like to tell you what temperature it is right now, but I can't. I don't even know what time it is, as you can see. I love it though. I love the fact that we've got no complications. Just black and white, literally, um, speedo and mileage that's it does you good once in a while to uh, to get rid of the technology i'd love to be able to get rid of the mobile phone i'd love it because we're so consumed with it it's, it's just everything we do is wrapped around that bloody stupid device that's in our hands and i hate it couldn't live without it don't get me wrong uh, and i don't want to but i'd love to be able to because you do feel quite liberated when your battery goes and you've got nothing when you let go of the fact that you know it doesn't matter if I don't receive, if I don't uh, reply to emails immediately, or if you just find yourself um, looking on Instagram for the sake of looking on it, and Facebook, and Twitter, and it's just a bit of a bad uh, state of affairs, really. Before you know it, ten years of your life's gone by with you looking at a screen. Looking at a screen. That's a bit dark, isn't it? I don't want to start this video being that dark. Let's go back to being. Let's go back to being uh, positive. Hey! So as you can see, I'm a little bit cooler. I look a little bit cooler than I did last time when I went out. Last time I went out on it, the first time I went out on it, I only had on uh, my um, Gore-Tex suit, adventure boots, and uh, and uh, Gore-Tex gloves, winter gloves. Whoa. And um, so I dug out my leather. It's nice to be wearing leather again. I've got my uh, my black boots on now, my normal boots, and my summer gloves. So I look a bit more fitting. I have still got my uh, shark helmet on. Well, that's going to have to stay because if I had a piss pot lid on, I wouldn't be able to talk to you, would I? Or film it. But you know, I I, I just I love this. I really, really. I, I I didn't think for a second that I'd love it. I thought I like it. I'd enjoy it, but I love it. It just feels so nice just to be able to get out and sit back and be lazy, you know. Tootling through the country roads, just really lazy, one-handed, laid back and just, yeah man, just, yeah, it's cool. I had a call from Manny, our friend over in Georgia. He calls quite regularly actually, and uh, anyway, he called and I answered the phone by saying, uh, make it quick, you son, bitch. And he laughed his head off and he said, and he just said, oh, I see, so you rode a Harley Davidson and now you think you're American. <laughs> I said, oh, no, no, I thought that I was American for a long time. <laughs> anyway, he was saying uh, that he'd seen the Harley video and that. And he says, we call, we call that, that kind of, that style Harley over here, we call that style a bar hopper. I'm like, oh, okay, why is that then? He said, because they're only good for going bar to bar, hopping to the next bar. Well, that's exactly my description of it, really. It's ace, just for having a quick hour out. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yeah, I think she's going to be very photogenic. I love the matte black paint. And I was speaking to Bri as well. Um, in the last video, I was talking about how, how much I liked the mirrors being where they are. Um, and Bryce said he'd done that himself just decided to put them down there instead of up there. But I think that's fantastic, absolutely brilliant. And I suggest everybody else does the same, because that it looks so cool, and it's so easy to see behind you. Oh, he also said that, I was mentioning the noise, he was also mentioning that these are the quiet baffles. <laughs> and if I want the noisy ones, to go and collect them. Jesus! Manny was also saying, another piece of uh, info that I didn't know, I wasn't aware of, that Harley Davidson have the sound patented, or trademarked, whatever, 
you know, the potato, 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 potato sound. And I think that's very cool. I don't think I've said cool so many times whilst riding a bike. That's the only word that I want to say while I'm on this bike. Just cool. Just cool. I think it goes around corners just lovely. gonna echo like mad up here because it's just tree line both sides all the way up so it's gonna definitely echo Quite comfortable. I think Brian's changed that as well. So I've looked at some pictures and uh, a lot of them are like double seats. This is just a single saddle. It's really nice. It's like you, you, the, the position of it, you're like slotted into it. Let's see if we can scrape these pegs. bike this is I have got to say I am a fan of the Harley and I can absolutely tell why so many people love it and why there's such a cult following it's like I said in my uh, first video you know you can t you can tell it's been put together with the uh, spanners you know sometimes you want to you want to go back to basics don't you and that's exactly what it feels like totally basic I'll get my fish and chips 40 and this car in front is doing 25 Arr! I bet it's going to be busy over here tonight. See if I can get anywhere near. get some tea which one which one that one is a table there look let's go for it I've just realised I've been riding for the last two hours without the number plate kicked out. <laughs> I've got all these offers coming in of uh, subscribers rides for my uh, sub rides series. Thank you so much everybody. Nice sunset behind me. I'm 
I've not got my DSLR because of that. Been lovely. So we've got a load of detail in the sky. Not just a boring blue sky. Got loads of cloud detail. A little bit of a t photography tip for you all. Sky with detail. You point any camera at that, it's going to expose for the sun. So everything else will look dark. With the DSLR, you shoot raw, exposed to the highlights, which is the sun, everything that's the brightest, because you can lift your shadows in post-production. If you if you exposed for the shadows now, so your blacks and your bike look really nice, the sky will be completely white, just completely blown out, and you can't pull the highlights back. Once your highlights are blown, they're gone. So exposed for your highlights, and lift your shadows. Your photo will look rubbish, too dark, then you can lift your shadows to bring it back to where it needs to be. There you go. Let's have a quick look at her. It's a fine piece of machinery, that is. All these are bits that the owners put on. All extras. I'm not too keen on the front view. The side profile I think looks absolutely belting. I really love the side profile. Yeah, not so much the back profile either, but the side. That looks gorgeous.